After a 20-year hiatus, Penn State and the Fiesta Bowl renewed their mutual love affair when the Nittany Lions extended their record to 7-0 and zero in the Arizona desert by beating the Washington Huskies. Against Washington on the Penn Ultimate afternoon of 2017, the Nittany Lions never trailed the team that had edged them out for the fourth spot in the college football playoff in 2016, the previous year. Penn State amassed a bowl record 545 yards of total offense or are rolling to its second straight 11-win season, its 29th bowl victory, and its second postseason decision over the Huskies. The Huskies defense that year ranked number one in the nation against the run and fifth in total defense and had allowed only one rush of 40 yards and one pass 35 yards in the season. In the first 21 minutes of action, Deshaun Hamilton grabbed a 48-yard touchdown pass and Saquon Barkley uncorked a 92-yard gallop to the end zone to spark the Lions to a 28-14 halftime lead. Super Saquon dazzled the witnesses at his last game in a Penn State uniform in typical fashion by setting a school and Fiesta Bowl record with his 92-yard touchdown trot that exceeded Chafee Field's previous Fiesta Bowl high of 85 yards on a reverse against Texas in state's last appearance in Arizona in 1996. Barkley equaled in one run the number of yards allowed per game by Washington's number one ranked rush defense. In his stellar season finale, quarterback Trace McSorley mystified the Washington defense by mixing in 12 runs for 60 crucial yards while completing a phenomenal 78% of his 41 pass attempts for 342 yards, 10 third down conversions, and two touchdowns. Coach James Franklin said in his post-game meeting with the media, I can't imagine there's a better quarterback in the country in terms of decision-making, leadership, and toughness. The junior's performance earned him the Most Valuable Offensive Player Award in the Fiesta Bowl, just as his play in the Big Ten Championship game did the previous year. The young man whose teammates call him a clutch player distributed his tosses to nine different receivers, including Deshaun Hamilton. The senior hauled in touchdown throws of 48 and 24 yards that were the alpha and omega of Penn State's scoring. Tight end Mike Jasicki caught six passes for 62 yards to finish his four-year career with a Penn State record for tight ends of 129 receptions. Barkley actually led all Lion receivers in the Fiesta Bowl with seven catches against Washington, just enough to tie Jawan Johnson as the Lions' leader for all of 2017 with 54 receptions. Saquon's 38 receiving yards in the bowl game added to his game-high 137 rushing yards and just 18 carries to give him a game-high 175 all-purpose yards. That raised his season total to 2,329, second only to Larry Johnson's 2,655 in 2002 in the Penn State's record books. The once-in-a-generation player stands second on State's all-time rushing chart with 3,843 yards and a career total of 43 touchdowns, all accomplished in just three years. He is the first Penn Stater to win the Paul Horning Award as the most versatile player in college football and was also a finalist for the Maxwell, Doak Walker, and Walter Camp Player of the Year Awards. He became just the second player in history to win three Big Ten Conference major awards, Offensive Player of the Year, Running Back of the Year, and Return Specialist of the Year. 
Senior safety Marcus Allen led the Lions with seven tackles, six of them solos, and received the defensive MVP trophy. Overall, State's defense had eight tackles for 33 yards and losses against the Huskies and held them to just 104 yards rushing and 227 passing. McSorley, who compiled 402 yards passing and running for a Penn State Bowl record, became the first Penn Stater in history to surpass 400 yards of total offense twice in his career and broke his own record for total offense in a season with 4,061 yards. Senior wide receiver Hamilton posted his eighth career 100-yard receiving game and passed Deion Butler on State's career receiving yardage chart with 2,842 yards to move into second place behind Bobby Ingram. In addition to Barkley's consensus first-team All-American honor and numerous other awards, tight end Jasicki garnered second-team All-American honors, safety Marcus Allen, linebacker Jason Cabinda, and quarterback McSorley received honorable All-American mentions. <laughs>